Hi friends, this is Susie, your gaming guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 307 in Best Fiends. This one's called X Explosion. Uh-oh, goals are to defeat a boss slug and clear out 48 green muck. I'll tell you right now, I generally lose these the first time around, so this one might be a long one for me. Look at how awful he is. Let's just check. Uh, yeah, 236,000 points to get to him, and we don't have the help of blue or yellow. But that may be a benefit, because then we can concentrate these other colors. We've got Lapoleum, we've got Moose, and we've got Whisper. And I don't, I don't know about that. I need to get down here, and it's hard to get that on the angle I need with Moose. I'm just, I tend to not do well with him. So let's take a look at changing our fiends. A uh, tantrum would be the one, right, to use in this case. So I like that. And Vincent could be good, but I do like how Napoleon has a blast uh, bomb, an area bomb, and can take out these groups of the sludge, the green slime, green muck. I think that's what it's called. Okay. So Tantrum, is Tantrum the one I want? I think so. And then let's go ahead and see about upgrading these fiends right away, because, you know, it's a boss level. Uh, let's see. If I upgrade... He's 16 already. Whisper is only 10. If I upgrade Whisper, I won't be able to get very far. Not with the yellow meteor mites I have. Because I have recently upgraded Lapoleon. Well, we're getting pretty far there, though. That's about it for me. I get to 13, or I can start using diamonds. Well, why not use diamonds? 481, I've got plenty. So I'm going to get the meteor mites I need. There we go. Now I have zero there. And I'm going to evolve. I think. 1,200 diamonds. I think it's well worth it. There we go. Ah, look at her. So Whisper is now evolved and helpful, and it looks like she has some sort of wand. Okay, I think I feel good about that. Everyone looks pretty good there. All right, so let's see what we can do with this. I've got this ticking time bomb. I need to get rid of it. Uh, but I really need to focus, I think, on all of these logs. If I get more slime on the board, I'm not going to worry too much. I need to get rid of the logs so I have more space so I can put more things together so I can get more bombs. It just so happens I'm hitting this each time, so now it's exposed. Now it's a danger to me, and it'll start ticking down. But the more I hit it, the quicker it goes. Do I do this? Well, let's check the bomb status. Not great. Bomb status here, not great. There's no strong reason to not do this. I'm not going to focus on making sure I don't get slimed, but if I can't avoid getting slimed, it will be best. All right, there we go. This looks good. Now we've gotten in here. Uh, I would really like that red because the red can help me get down to... The detonator. I need to expose the detonator and then use the detonator. Looks like these are going to be a problem throughout the board. And then, of course, anytime we have a boss level, he's got these munchers he throws out at us. Not a fan. I think I'm going to grab the red over here. Get rid of that muncher. And the green over here. Get rid of that muncher. But what I really want... Oh, I've got a bomb now. What I really want is get down here. Let's see, if I do this, I don't get a bomb yet. If I do this, I don't get a bomb yet. If I do this, I get another bomb. All right, and a bomb I can probably use. Oh, J. G. I can't, I can't talk this morning. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to set off that bomb. It's going to get rid of munchers, and it's going to open this further so that if I can get a red bomb, I'll have a better spot to put it. And if I can't, maybe I've got a good spot 
to put the purple. Not quite. It's not awful. But I'm going to do this. Get a red bomb. And then, does it reach? No. Not quite yet. Let's take out this green. It reaches all the way down here. And then, this is good. Oh gosh, muncher. I can use this. It hits the muncher. It opens this up. And then I'm going to try to detonate using this. And we're going to start using the, what? We're going to start using the dynamite to help us clear things. All right, look at this. And this gets us 30,000 points against the slug. Bombs are the way to go to make points against the slug. Now that that's open, I'm going to focus more on how many points I'm getting each turn. So if I go like this and grab all these red. I hit the detonator and I get 14,000 points and I get a bomb created. All right, so that looks good. That's probably my best shot because everything else is divided. Yeah, I don't see anything that's going to work any better than this. It's taking out muck, especially that really thick layer. It doesn't hit this, but I still have nine shots at that. I'm hoping to get dynamite and bombs to help with that. I only have one dynamite. Is it worth it to set it off now? Well, if I do this, I get 18,000 points and I get rid of the munchers. That's not bad. I also get rid of some of the green muck. If I do this... Hold on around this way. I get rid of the munchers, I get 39,000 points. And I still have the bomb intact, and maybe I'll get more dynamite on the board to do more dangerous stuff. No more dynamite yet. The green muck is really going away. I'm going to keep an eye on it, but I'm not going to focus on it. All right. What if I come around this way? Yeah, 33,000 points. It looks like I might get this slug done right away. Like I'm not going to struggle for t turns and turns to get that done. What if I do this? It gets rid of a muck. And another muck. It's 15,000 points. It hits the detonator. I like that. Percentage. I like to see how the percentage here. I like to see how that is ticking down. All right. I need to get over here, but look what I'm going to do. This is going to be fun. Grab that. Come around here and grab this. That's a lot. It gets rid of the slug. It gets rid of a lot of slime. Look at that. Boss slug defeated. That's the only thing I have left. Well, as far as boss levels go, this one's my favorite because, yay, got it done with five moves left. That means I get to collect extra fun things with the stuff I have left on the board, and it was my first shot at it. So, I don't know. I think it's because I've been upgrading my fiends more, which of course makes sense if you want to do better bring in stronger characters. Uh-oh, whenever Temper comes up and says, I feel lucky, I feel today is my lucky day, hopefully I'll get a jackpot. Oh, I thought it, I was going to maybe get a fiend, but he's talking about a jackpot. So yeah, I got a jackpot. So it was uh, ripe for a jackpot. I want fiends though, so I want to keep collecting those fiends, but I can't complain about that. That was fun. All right, that's it for me. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. I hope you have as much luck and success getting the boss done as I did. If not, think about upgrading. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.